Welcome back to Tales of Asperia. We entered Cave Mock this time around. Woof! Find something, repeat! Oh, woof woof, arg. Those guys are the hunting blades. What the hell happened? We were done in by a huge monster. Uh, if only the chief were here. Nan's all alone, please! Nan! Hey, what are you doing charging in by yourself? I'll go too. It's finally Carol's time to shine, don't you think so? His time to shine? <laughs> oh, come on. I could take that thing out in like one hit. Kisha! Punishing smash! Go, Carol. Man, are you okay? Carol, why are you... Huh? What happened here? Man, explain this. Oh, yes, sir. When you and the others went to the in to hunt the monsters, a huge monster suddenly appeared. And that monster beat everyone? Yes, but Carol... Carol defeated the monster. Uh, but I didn't do it alone. Carol, you did this? Dot, dot, dot. Uh, uh, you helped us out. You have my thanks. Uh, eh? It's not every day that the chief thanks someone. Anyway, have my... You have my thanks as well. Uh, no. I mean, you don't have to... This is for you. Huh? What is this? It's a piece of clothing I made from the fangs and tusks of a monster that I slew recently. It had the most amazing golden tusks. Its tusks were made of gold? I thought it wouldn't look right on anyone who isn't strong enough, but I think it'll suit you just fine. Huh? You mean... Well, I'm going now. Next time I see you, I'm going to be stronger too. Uh, okay. Looks like she dropped something. Then I'll get stronger too. Carol earned the Golden Soldier title, obtained Letter of Challenged Hunting Blades, and that makes three of the four uh, Letters of Challenge we need to go and compete in the 100 Man Melee. Now I am free to go and do it completely, but first off, the complete costume of Carol. <laughs> yes, ah, nope, wrong button. Um, yes, this is the final costume of Carol. All in golden, his mustache, and his pipe. I think the pipe adds a bit of class to the all too clashy. Actually, with the bag, it kind of looks neat. <laughs> the bag matches. Anyways, that is all you want to do here in Cave Mock. And yeah, now we have access to the 100 man melee. You could also. Um, I'm going to make a side note. The. Uh, Wonder Chef I found in uh, Nam Kabada, Kabadanda, is actually the was actually the very last uh, chef you could get in the uh, game. Like the what, last one that teaches you a recipe. There are others that will you can find another one here. I'm pretty sure you'll see one here eventually if you've been cooking. Uh, you will find the chef and uh, you can actually enter a cooking contest and everything. I'm not going to do it yet just because I haven't touched any of the recipes. I'm waiting till I'm training to enter the last, to fight the last battle. Uh, in, like the last dungeon in the game. I'm going to do a bunch of training beforehand because the last boss uh, is going to be quite difficult after I get all the fell arms. And I'm going to continue talking here. So yeah, if you have all the... Uh, all the recipes and you've been mastering them and whatnot. Uh, you can enter this, uh, you can talk to the Wonder Chef and you'll be, uh, invited to this contest. And, uh, yeah, there's, it's, I'll be, I'll do it later on, eventually, but, uh, not right now. So, uh, later episode. Anyways, I've already set up Yuri for this, so we're going to go and do the 100 man melee. Uh, so you can do any of the other melees you want, but, uh, yeah. Actually, you know what? I'm going to do a smaller melee just to see if I can fit it into this episode here. Uh, sure. I'll give the 30-man melee a go. So all these letters of challenge uh, make it so that you'll be able to fight uh, the people that you pick them up from in this thing. So just go up here after you set up everything and go. I've already set it up. I set it up in between episodes. Welcome to Polly Strollers, yeah, yeah, formidable opponents. This is the easiest of the challenges. This is just to show it off. I'm going to do the 100 man melee for Yuri in the next episode. Okay, so, 
We have five minutes to take out as many of them as we possibly can. I have, uh, I have equipped the uh, weapon, the uh, accessory I got from uh, the Namkabata, the one that uh, increases my health and TP after every kill. So as you can see, every time I kill something, I'm gaining uh, 484 uh, HP and uh, some spear, uh, some TP as well. And I'm going to go and take out the witch. Burn the witch! Oh wait, 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 wait. Uh, there's uh, another witch over here. Oh no, not that witch. There we go. Okay, ready? Burn the witch! Oh, she's dousing my flames. Ah, no, he dodged. So yeah, uh, the 30-man melee is quite easy. In all honesty, at this point, these guys are all Nordopolica area monsters and before and like Halur. So you should have absolutely no problem at this point. If you have a problem with this fight, you are playing this game wrong. I'm sorry. Anyways, as soon as you reach 28 and out of 30 killed, look who shows up. Yes, these two are going to show up. Um, you want to make sure you magic lens them. You are given a set of items for the uh, melees. So we got a level 35 jerk here. We will take you back to the capital. I stunned him, apparently. Cool. Anyways, yeah, you are given a limited number of items, as you can see. You get one limit bottle, etc., etc. But uh, you do walk in with whatever overlimit gauge you had before, I believe. So uh, that would be a good tip for you. Um, I should note, for the melees, I have actually gotten rid of my special technique. I do not have special or hit plus on there, just because the overlimits are so much better uh, in like single levels in these. Because really, you if you use an overlimit in this, if you're using a Mystic Art in this, it's pretty much overkill on everything here, and you're wasting three overlimits which you could use to kill a lot more enemies. That's my little tip. Anyways, we have beaten the 30-man melee. I guess I probably could have gone through the 50. You get a bunch of items every time you win one of these. Yeah. So I'm going to end this episode off really, really, really early. I'm sorry, guys, but um, I want to go and do the 100-man melee next, and uh, I don't think I'm going to be able to fit it in this episode. <gasps> Fancy that! It's 100 people. Um, actually, I think it gives you like a 20-minute timer, if I remember correctly. <laughs> uh, I'm hoping I could fit it in under the 11-minute time limit. Yeah! Stupid time limits. Anyways, it is now daytime, so we are going to go do this in the daytime. See you guys next time when we take on the 100-man melee with Yuri.